Hello, I'm Luke Nella, and welcome to Best Few Plays of the Week. In this episode, we have an Aikido master in a pattern, a scout risking everything for a shiny medal, and a defender who doesn't worry about defense points. Let's watch. We'll start with a steel wall from the EU region, where Battle Hammer drives the VK4502P in a tier 10 slugfest. The match is an encounter on Lakeville, and the VK pushes east towards the town. Artillery fire rains down, and an enemy sniper takes out the commander. Luckily, a bit of gauze gets him back on his feet. Battle Hammer trades fire with tank destroyers, pushes forward and takes out an object 704. Borsich has a go and gets wrecked. The British medium tank doesn't fare any better, but the tier 10 artillery strike does sting a bit. Perhaps it's best to avoid those in the future. Battle Hammer is busy dismantling a 30 when enemies suddenly pounce from the side. The side armor proves quite thin, but quick angling of the tank saves it from destruction. The four on one odds are not enough and the steel wall stands. Battered, but unbroken. The SVG is late to the party and gets swatted down like a fly. The enemies are down to a single fast mover arty, which Battlehammer picks off with a sniper shot. Good game. That was an excellent demonstration on the importance of positioning and angling from Battlehammer. We're off to a good start now, so let's continue. Let's hop over to the North American servers with a scout replay from Killer99209. The vehicle is a Type 64 light tank, and the Tier 8 encounter is fought on Malinavka. Killer heads out, puts a shell into an MT-25, and almost runs straight into half of the enemy team. The Type has a decent gun, but it would probably be a very bad idea to fire it just now. The type moves a bit forward and gets spotted. Amazingly, the air rail shot bounces. Since the location has been revealed anyway, Killer starts taking shots at the enemies. Moving fully into the combat role, Killer helps gun down a rival light tank and chases after a T-25-2. The TD puts up a fight, but it's no match for the agility of the Type 64. Borsi should be an easy target from here, but somehow it refuses to die. Killer looks for a better angle, and the same thing happens again. Right. The last ally finishes off the troublesome TD, and Killer goes looking for the remaining enemies. The RT is found and put down. That leaves a T-28, which the Stura Immel finds and then gets killed by. The big TD is powerful, but it is helpless against an agile light tank. An engine fire takes it down to 106 hit points, and Killer decides to go for a Faden's medal as a bonus. Three shells get punched into the dirt, and the last one will have to count. A low roll would be disastrous, but luck is with the scout, and the game ends in victory. Hmm, the showboating at the end could have gone terribly wrong there, but aside from that, it was very solid scouting. Well done! We head to the Asian region for this week's Defender game. SXE8894X is one of those players who seems to choose their nicknames just to mess with me. And even the tank has the catchy name of Object 430 version 2. It's the third encounter battle of this episode, this time a tier 9 fight on steps. Our Defender heads east and sets up a Hunter's Blind. The defender's patient runs out just as the enemies arrive. Oh well, back in the cover.
The concealments work well, but eventually it's time to get up close and personal. Here we go, the Fosh dies quickly, as does the Panther Spy. A T-10 pounces on the object, but gets immediately ammo wrecked by an ally. The team settles in the capture circle, but this isn't an invader award. As it happens, the enemies turn up on all sides at once, and our defender leaves the circle to take them on. The French autoloader's drive-by shooting ends badly. SXC punishes the Type 61 and finishes off the FV-4202. But the pressure from the enemies is relentless. The E-75 charges and the Object 704 finishes off the big Allied TD. SXC deals with the heavy, cuts the track of the object and retreats into safety. The IS-7 follows only to get tracked as well. The last ally gives fire support while SXC outmaneuvers both opponents. Taking out the Tier 10 Heavy and retreating once again. The object follows and the final showdown is fought in a boneyard of dead tents. The turretless TD doesn't really have a chance here though, and victory goes to the Defender. There you go guys, that's how you win the Defender Award with all of three defense points to your name. Just leave a field of wrecked enemies all around the capture zone. Staying on the agent server, we have a top gun from Predator, who drives the M46 pattern on Pilsen. The early game is efficient, but not very exciting. Predator stays on the eastern flank, taking shots of opportunity. Plenty of damage dealt, but no kills. Things get more intense as the pattern moves to the center of the map and engages a T-95. Killing the TD is not a problem, but there are plenty of enemies left and just a single ally remaining. The pattern draws back from the city, but the last ally doesn't make it out. One against six then, so be it. This is a Top Gun game after all. Predator starts by picking off a Waffenträger and winning a face-off with an SPG. The Löwe comes barreling in and suddenly all four remaining enemies are converging on the pattern. The pattern accelerates out of the envelopment and picks off the object. Maneuvering perfectly, Predator uses the T-34 as a shield and puts two shells into the Löwe without taking a single hit. Even an Aikido Master couldn't keep this up forever, and the pattern takes two punishing hits. Predator punches a hole in the T-34 and suffers another hit in return. The pattern can't keep trading blows with the heavies, so Predator tracks one of them and uses it for cover. Pretty soon, the game comes down to a one versus one. After that display, how do you think the duel will go? You are absolutely right. The M103 seems utterly helpless as the pattern dismantles it at will. Game over. Wow, that brawl at the end had some of the best tactical driving we have ever seen on the show. Top Gun of the Week with style. Our season finale comes from the North American region where three TDs team up to fight on highway. Jailbroken in the M56 Scorpion, a Dizzle in the E25 and Nigel 561 in the SU-12244. Let's see them go at it. Jailbroken rushes to claim a position in the city while a Dizzy engages and destroys a Panther, masquerading as an M10. The enemies are making a determined push into the city and Jailbroken and Nigel both claim a kill in the fighting. Some distance away from the city, a Dizzle scores a second hit on a Sherman 3. Joe Broken follows suit while Nigel duels a Porsche Tiger on the flank. Unfortunately, things go south for the SU and Nigel succumbs to superior numbers. Joe Broken takes revenge on the Tiger and escapes from a VK Heavy with seconds to spare. The last ally is dead and the game is two against seven. A Dizzle pounces on the VK and the platoon mates dismantle it together. Another Tiger tries its luck, but it doesn't last for long. The pair of TDs head back north. A rival E25 nearly beats a Dizzle and Jailbroken struggles with an AMX ELC. A Dizzle comes in to help and manages to land the kill shot. All the remaining opponents are TDs and the first one met is a Störer Immel. 
Broken takes it on while Adizzle sets up a flanking attack. The rest of the enemies join the fight while Adizzle is busy finishing off the first one. The final confrontation is fought cautiously from long range. The platoon prevails with both players scoring one last kill. Very nice. It's a shame Nigel fell early in the fighting, but it did make the end game that much more intense. Thanks for sending in several replays of the battle as well. It makes it much more likely we can use your game on the show. <laughs> and that's it for season three. Don't worry, we'll be back in a few weeks with season four. So hit that subscribe button to be notified when the new season starts. I'm Luke Nella, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. dun. Hey, meathead. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. dun. Hunted by. Swag. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Fine!